The second interoperability we'll look at is between pipe stress and structural. This is done using AutoPipe and STAD, which are both Bentley products. So as an overview, first the pipe stress analysis is done in AutoPipe by the pipe stress engineer according to uh, pipe stress criteria. Concurrently, the structural analysis is done in STAD Pro by the structural engineer using structural criteria. Once both teams have their models and analysis passing their own criteria, the integration can start. And this is done by exporting the piping model, the supports, and the loads from AutoPipe to STAD through a file called a PipeLink file. And here you'll see that the STAD model will be updated to include the piping, the piping supports, and then the structural engineer will have the task of connecting the structure to the piping through the pipe supports and transferring the piping loads to the structural loading. Rerunning the analysis, now including the piping loads, and making any changes as necessary, maybe adding bracing or increasing structural sizes to again pass the structural criteria. Once that's done, the structural engineer can export the structural model and support connections that were made in STAD, again through the pipe link file over to AutoPipe. This pipe link file can be imported into AutoPipe. Here you see that the AutoPipe model is updated to include the structure and also to include the support connections that were made on the structural side. The pipe stress engineer now has to rerun the pipe stress analysis, which is now including the flexibility of the structure to make sure that we are still passing pipe stress criteria. If not, changes can be made and this can be an iterative process, but again, an automatic iterative process. We're getting rid of any manual transfer of data. So this integration between AutoPipe and STAD is the only one of its kind, and it can be a single or multi-user modeling environment, and it has full bi-directional exchange of data. So the end results lead to faster design. We're combining the structure and piping model with changed piping loads automatically updated multiple times in STAD, and transferring the piping and support loads in hours instead of weeks. We're including the combined structure and piping model to analyze the true combined stiffness for more accurate, safer structural and piping designs. We are making less assumptions. We're including accurate pipe supports and equipment loads and realistic structural and piping design flexibilities and stresses. And this can all lead to cost savings. Early clash detection can be seen to avoid costly redesign and construction delays. And there's potential cost savings on pipe supports and steel structure now that we're considering uh, real flexibilities and real support loads.